Keith Lawson of Dale here at Pentacon 2020, and I gratefully welcome you to this episode of Thor Talks to Marcy Moon, aka Deadpool Lorian. How are you doing? I am wonderful. I'm missing out some chimichangas, though. Yeah, aren't we all? I love some chimichangas. Um, so that's the wrong card. Apologies on that. Let's switch around. We're clearly unprofessional and unprepared. It's Deadpool vibes. Oh, shirt. There we are. We got to the card. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> um, so how long have you been coming to Pentagon? Five years. Five. Five. Five years. She skipped four. It's all right. It's a Thor joke. So, um, uh, what kind of community or charity work do you do, Te Deadpool Lorian? Uh, well, what is your favorite part of the con life, Deadpool Lorian? All those sweet heinies walking around. <laughs> All right, take two. Uh, how are you doing, for reals oh, this time? I'm doing really good. I'm doing really awesome. It's fun here, so like, I'm doing really good. I just ate. It was awesome. Uh, food, something that's not happened yet. Um, so how long have you been coming to Pinscon? Has it been five years? It has been seven years since it started. Seven. Who knows how to count? I don't know how to count. Not Thor, not her. Definitely not me. Yeah. How long have you been cosplaying? And you're an artist, right? Mm, yes, I am an artist over here in Artist Alley. And how long have you been A, cosplaying, and B, drawing slash creating? Cosplaying about five years, drawing slash creating since, I don't know, baby? This big? Uh, something, yeah. When you were a baby spider lass. Yes, yes. Naturally, naturally. Um, so what, what would you say as a cosplayer? What is your favorite cosplay that you have done? The one I'm currently wearing. Yes. I concur. That is amazing. I didn't know I needed it in my life. And notice the duct tape holding baby Spidey in there with his little He's tunic. so safe. So safe. He ain't going nowhere. Look at him. He's safe. I could hit him, but it's whatever. He'll, he has speed healing. He's a spider. Uh, ironically, I meant to do this at your booth simply for the can you show us some of what you have to purchase at this fine establishment? But how about instead you tell us and I'll just cut B-roll in later. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god! I do all the different fandoms, everything like that. I have like a lot of Harry Potter, Star Wars, Star Trek, things like that. They're prints. They're 11 by 17, all one size. So there you go. What kind of community work or charity work do you do, if at all? Um, I actually do like a lot for Pensacon. I will paint live paintings and they auction it off for Mana Food Pantries. So like... What is that? It is the food bank here where oh. they give food to people that don't have food. We're not local. Oh, what the heck? You have to tell us. Oh, my bad. Mana Food Bank is awesome. I forgot. Yeah, so Mana Food Bank is a charity here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Too far, other Thor. This is why your oatmeal only got destroyed. That was a sentence, I swear. <laughs> So what is your favorite part of con life? Is it the high knees or is it anything else? It is the high knees. <laughs> when you see some like nice high knees walk by, it's fun. But no, it's like the community. Everybody's like really friendly and nice no matter what. Cosplayers are so nice to each other. Like just they always say good job even though like you know somebody just started cosplaying. It's it's amazing. It's one of my favorite things. I uh community's always lovely and she obviously helps feed people who cannot feed themselves. That was a really good answer. <laughs> Where can folks find you? Where can people buy your art if they're obviously, they're not here at Pentagon because this, yes. this is coming out after Pentagon, five sure. So where can they buy your stuff? At my website at www.marcymoon.com. She's professional. She has a website. I do. Some Thor should get on that. I'm looking at you, future Thor editing. Uh, is there anything else you'd like to plug while you're here? Any, any other fun things that you have coming up? No, I just want chimichangas because that burger was not enough. It wasn't enough. I want chimichangas. It's not enough, Dad! What if I want wings? Name that movie. But I want wings now. What was that? No. No shawarma. It's not Black Hawk Down. But it, it, the movie's Step Brothers. For those of you that don't know, watch it. Oh. You're alive, Brennan. You're alive. All right. I want to thank Marcy Moon for talking with me today. And I wish you success and love in your journey. And I want to thank you for tuning into this episode of Thor Talks 2. Marcy Moon, a.k.a. Deadpool Lorian with a baby Spidey. 
Please don't forget to like and subscribe slash follow so you can follow Thor's journey across the multiverse. I will see you next time and I love you. Wow, another great interview completed and I wanted to add a post-credits plug of gratitude. Thank you again to my guest for speaking with me today. I wish you much success on your journey. And thank you to the Gulf Coast Titans for giving me the opportunity to go to Pensacon and put smiles on everyone's faces. The Gulf Coast Titans are a volunteer cosplay group out of Panama City, Florida, with the sole purpose of spreading love of characters and happiness to all ages. Be sure to like and follow them on Facebook and Instagram so that you can book them for your character needs. Lastly, I would like to thank the folks in charge of Pensacon for giving me the opportunity to speak with such beautiful souls as you have seen here today. Do not forget to follow and like their Facebook and Instagram so that you can stay up to date on Pensacon 2021. <laughs>